Hey guys, Morbi Man here, back with episode 2 on career mode. And jumping straight in, we get a loan offer from uh, Bray Wanderers for this 18 year old uh, strike we've got. So I go ahead and accept that, so hopefully he'll get some good progress while he's over there. And then we go into our first competitive game in the league, which is against Wickham Wanderers. Um, as you can see, we got our new signing centre back in. Uh, and I think we've got another striker on the bench, so yeah. Anyway, uh, here we go. They get the first goal, unfortunately, which is a bit of a, a quite good goal, but still quite sweaty for the computer and quite an annoying one to concede. Um, but yeah, so then we went in at half time and we were 1 0 down. So I knew we were, I wasn't playing that well, so we needed to step it up. <coughs> and we luckily managed to do that through, um, well, I'll let you see see it first yeah here's O'Connor and he just smashes it right in the top corner he's got a, a really decent left foot on him so that's really good to see from him and I think it's well deserved as well and then here in the uh, 80th minute 88th minute from the corner we get the goal to win it which uh, if I was on your end of I'd be pretty pissed off of but there you go Still good to win it, so uh, we get the first win in the in the season, so that's good. We get the full three points, and then we jump into a game here against Ipswich in the Capital One Cup. So this is going to be quite difficult because Ipswich are a Championship team, so they're likely to have some good players. But hopefully, we'll manage, we'll manage to beat them. And yeah, they get the kick off, and uh, in w went in at half time, and it was nil nil. So it's quite a sort of stale, quite boring game, but quite even which was good for us because we're obviously a lot worse team uh, but yeah here we go and I think we'll, yeah, we uh, managed to get the first goal here that guy Nardillo passes it to no, yeah, to Agard and he cannons it off the, off the post but managed Agard managed to uh, clear it up and this good strike has finished there which is good for, and this is good for us because it's which are obviously a much better team so here we intercept the ball of O'Connor again. Pass it to Agard and another pass through to uh, Nardillo and he puts it right in the back of the net in the 18th minute to seal the victory. Which is good, very good for us. Some good interplay and there they see 2-0 full time. So we're free to the next round of the Capital One. Um, and then uh, last game in this episode, another league game against Accrington. Um, and hopefully we'll win this because that Quinton wa are one of the be worst uh, teams in the league, so we'll see how it goes. But yeah, uh, you see in Ainsworth to Nardilio, back to Agard, plays a lovely one too, and he's through on goal. I've, I jumped that a bit early there, but luckily we managed to get the header anyway to get the goal in the 45th minute, just before half time, which is good for the morale. And then, as you can see there, Going into half time, one one nil up. Yep. So we kick it off here, and then here's our second goal of the game. Nadillo passes it through to Lacointe, the 17-year-old, I brought as a sub, and he smashed it from outside of the box. What a quality finish! And uh, yeah, he seems to be a really good signing at the moment. Yeah, only 17, but he still can put away goals like that, which is really good to see. And yeah, 2 0, another victory and in the league, so we should be really near the top now. So yeah, if you enjoyed, watch the previous video, like, comment, and I'll see you all later. Bye.